Leptospirosis is a bacterial infection transmitted to humans from the urine of infected animals. Its spectrum of clinical manifestations vary from asymptomatic to severe disease. The classic triad of jaundice, renal failure and hemorrhage, described by the term Vell's disease, can be fatal. Microbiologically, the Leptospira species are spirochetes, a group of bacteria that are thin and spiral-shaped. They stain poorly, but can be seen microscopically by dark field examination. It's a zoonotic disease, with rats being the most important animal reservoir. The bacteria persist in the urogenital tract of rodents for years, and transmission may follow direct contact with animal urine. This makes certain occupational groups at high risk, like vets and sewerage workers. Transmission occurs through mucous membranes, especially the conjunctival and oral mucosa. The clinical syndromes associated with leptospirosis are often divided into two categories, anecteric leptospirosis and icteric leptospirosis, which is also known as Vell's disease. An icteric leptospirosis, which refers to the lack of scleral icterus, or jaundice, is much more common, and it's a milder disease with two phases, an acute phase and an immune phase. The acute phase lasts for a week and is characterized by an acute febrile bacteremia. Features include rigors and myalgia, classically in the form of calf muscle pain. Subsequently, the immune phase occurs in a small proportion of patients and is characterized by immune-mediated complications like aseptic meningitis. Conversely, Vell's disease, which is much more severe, occurs in 5% of cases and has a 5% mortality. It's a rapidly progressive, multi-system illness associated with fulminant hepatitis causing jaundice, renal failure resulting in anuria, and severe respiratory distress resulting in pulmonary hemorrhage. Investigations for the diagnosis of leptospirosis should be considered in patients with risk factors for the disease and features suggestive of it. Both PCR and serologic tests of the blood and urine are warranted, as well as CSF-PCR in patients that have presumed aseptic meningitis. Diagnosis is usually based on serology, but seroconversion can sometimes take several weeks, making PCR an important test in the early stages of disease. Now, its management is determined by the severity of infection. Generally, supportive measures, antibiotics, and prevention are key elements of treatment. In severe disease, renal replacement therapy and ventilatory support might be needed, but more commonly though, in mild disease, fluid resuscitation and symptom management may be the extent of supportive measures. Regarding antimicrobials, doxycycline is the preferred empiric therapy because it also treats for rickettsial infections which have similar presentations to leptospirosis. Prevention measures include avoiding potential sources of infection and administration of prophylaxis for individuals at a high risk of exposure and animal vaccination. Let's recap everything with a mnemonic. I remember that Biles disease is caused by spirals and the triad involves deranged EGFR, icterus, and lung damage. I also remember that rat pee is not clean and it needs doxycycline. Thanks for watching Townsend Teachings.